Hey, what's going on guys? It's Pat and welcome back to Minecraft Epic Proportions. And today I have a brilliant idea. What we're going to do is break into this structure right here. Honestly, I don't think we're powerful enough to like, you know, go through the whole thing and fight the boss. But what I'm going to do is grab the end stone from the floor. I remember from last season since we used it for the fanchion. And then I'm going to make the ender dragon bike so we can fly into the air and check out this awesome flying village. It's going to be sick. And I know there's like a lot of stuff there to grab, like so many chests. So hopefully we'll get some gear. We really need it. And I'm not ready to go like cave exploring and mining and stuff yet. Why, why must you do this? Do you have to kill everything? Can't you help with the cows instead? Got to kill the other girl. I see how it is. But anyways, yeah, that's the idea for today. I'm really hoping to get some stuff. And I'm not ready to go mining until we actually have the fanchion and everything completely set up. All right, so I've got six. I'm trying to get some leather so I can get some kind of protection. All I have right now are iron legs, and that's probably not going to be enough to um, survive the mobs. So I'm just going for a chest right now, so I need like eight leather. All right, come on, drop some leather, cows. You're mean. All right, one dude right here. I have a feeling he's going to drop two. I could like feel it. And he dropped one. <laughs> one when I said that. All right, so there's lots of cows around this area. There's like millions of them. So, guys, I was looking through the comments, and I noticed quite a few people did say we should spend a little bit more time looking for an awesome area for the Fanchion before I start putting people in. So, that is what we are going to do. I figured if I found the Ender Dragon, not found the Ender Dragon, made the Ender Dragon bike, then we can actually explore a little bit too and find some awesome areas today so we can definitely start it next time. But don't worry. Even though I haven't started it, every episode is going to have winners. So, I'm going to have like 30 people to put in or something ridiculous like that anyway. So, don't worry. Everyone is still going to get to be in the Fanchion. They'd already commented on the other episodes. All right, so I think I have enough here. Enough leather. Here we go. And yeah, more likes, more people in the Fanchion. So leave a like if you enjoy the series, and maybe you will get into the Fanchion. All right, so let me just pick this up. I don't want to lose this. It's valuable to me. She's like ready to go. Come on, wait one second. And yeah, that doesn't give much. Huh? Is it a bar and a half? I guess that's better than nothing. All right, I think I'm ready. Oh, you know what I should do is I should take off this right here. This stone sword's about to break. And I know that hers does not lose durability. Take this really bad one. There you go. And it's I to go into the battle gear section. All right, there we go. I'm ready. I am ready now. There's like cows everywhere. All right, so from the side, if we break through the side of the building instead of like entering, I think we could do it with just killing two spawners. They're not. Oh, my God. That is big freaking sugar can right there. <laughs> Oh, he's on a cow. That can't be good. The dude just spawned on a cow. He's a, he's ranged. Girlfriend, get him. Get him. I don't know how strong he is. I'm trying to get close to him without him, like, um, you know, owning me. All right, here we go. Double team him. Oh, is he rare? All right. She got him already. Did he drop anything? Didn't drop anything. She probably, like, stole the loot. I see how it is. I see how it is, girlfriend. Let me grab this giant sugar cane really quickly. I think it's from Tropicraft. That would be my guess. It actually is bamboo. And I use it for... I can make like... Oh, I could actually make some like building blocks out of it. Oh, I need it for the mug. And that's for going to the other dimension too. Something's shooting at me. Something's shooting at me. Oh, it's him. He missed every single time. Oh my god. How much damage does that do? All right. Yeah, we're definitely not ready to conquer this place. I feel like five hearts of damage in one shot. That is not good at all. All right. I'm safe. All right, so we got one spawner down. The second dude, he probably won't see me if I... He sees me. All right, that dude's got a bow too. How does everyone have a bow? All right. All right, switching back. Is she getting him? Get him. Finish him. All right. Oh, one more hit. Don't run. He's trying to get to his potion. No. Owned. Owned. Oh, other dude over there. No, you're not getting on the cow, bro. Get off the cow. Get off the cow. All right. Teamwork. Yeah, we did it. All right, I think we're good, actually. And I know last time I mentioned, I thought the more health mod had a bug, but it actually, you see how it has two hearts? It just shows right now the two next to it is that I'm on, like, the second bar of health. And if I take damage, it goes back to the first one. So it's kind, it's kind of interesting, actually. I like it. All right, so where are we in here? Oh, God, I'm right next to the stairs. That can't be good, can it? It's not exactly where I was shooting for. I hear, like, people coming in and outside. All right, so we need eight of this. I see spawners, but I'm not close enough, I don't think, to actually spawn them in. Although I hear mobs, like, entering and leaving. This is the worst spot ever. 
I'm next to both stairs to up and down. All right, get it up. Go, go, go. Why aren't you helping? I've got a awesome. We've got everything we need. Right, cow? Okay, okay. I, I'm, the stress is gone. I feel relieved. I feel relieved now. All right, so I'm going to put this down. It is still daytime, right? Where's the sun? Must be going down. I think it's behind the building. That's what it is. So, yeah, we do have the choice for this being the fan shit again, but I prefer not to just because we used it last season. We did use this floating village in season one. That's another choice, too. But, yeah, I'm going to take a look around, see if we can find something really cool, if possible, that we've never seen before. That would be awesome. All right, Ender Dragon Bike. Oh, yeah, love this thing. And it's so easy to make, too. I mean, just a little bit of end stone and a saddle. Can't really complain. All right, so I'm going to grab this. And, yeah, it's getting dark. Better better hurry here. Better hurry. All right. And I've got a red one. Cool. Let's go. The girlfriend, she'll, she'll figure her way around, right? I see, like, a little, like, pyramid around. All right. Anything else cool around here? Because there might be some awesome stuff. I don't know. I'm che Oh, God. That's Emperor Scorpion over there. How come you guys are harder to control than ever? The animal bikes seem a little bit harder to control than usual for some reason. I think that structure right there is actually the ticket vendor for the Lion King mod. I think it is. Um, let's see. Anything else around here? Oh, what's that? That actually looks kind of cool. Is that a... I think it's... Hold on. It's a zombie attacking a creeper statue. Would that be a cool spot for the fanchion? Like having signs on the side of that? That might be awesome, actually. I don't know. A couple ideas. Leave a comment. We're definitely starting it next time no matter what. Just so you guys know. And let's start exploring over here because it's like all the way on the end and that way i won't get confused about where we are oh there's a spider on the ceiling that can't be good oh oh fall off fall off okay bye <laughs> flying spider <laughs> that's what that was all right so yeah there's a lot of whoa there's a lot of golems around norm she made it thank god you're here but yeah there weren't golems originally in this place so that's cool and since i have more golems installed it changed them to all different kinds of golems that is so sick all right that's a hardened play golem Ooh, good chest music disc iron horse armor heart pieces golden apple sometimes there's chests in the ceiling i'll check those at the end but i want to just like walk through this place first yeah this is really cool look there's actually all kinds of golems here because one thing the more golems mod does is it makes it so um, when iron golems spawn, they spawn into a random golem. And I guess that's what happened here. That is so cool. It makes it like compatible with this mod. So yeah, right now we're actually in the dungeon pack mod. You know, this is the structure from it. And they have some cool stuff. Apparently they updated it and added golems to this structure. Even a diamond golem. How did you get hurt? You alright? There's mobs around and stuff. It is nighttime. Gotta protect the villagers. And, yeah, we can actually see down from here. I don't want to get knocked off or anything, though. <laughs> this place is so awesome. This is another choice for the Fanchion, guys. We haven't used it since Season 2 anyway. Stone Golem. And it seems to be fairly safe. I don't want any wooden hose, but you can have this nice sandstone. You okay? Did you fight something there? Oh, God, I hear lightning. It's not a nice day. Actually, looking down there, something looks weird. Look at the ground. It's like a weird, like thing of dirt it's, it's like it's a weird formation there's got to be something under there we were just over there too i didn't notice that unless we were in the air i guess yeah there's farms around here too so there's all kinds of stuff apparently they killed something over here don't fall off glass golem don't fall off it's dangerous up here and here we've got some bread heart container awesome that's an extra heart for us haven't seen any mutant creatures yet that's gonna be cool though when we do all right so i'm kind of hungry here I have, like, a lot of, like, raw meat now. That's good, though. Where's my girlfriend? I want to make sure she's full health. Yes, she is. You can just feed her, you know, the meat. All right, I ate it. Don't worry. I didn't mean to click on that, but I did. All right, so, yeah, a lot of farms around here. Sometimes there's animal farms, too. I haven't seen any yet. Not sure if there's any or not. I think they're a little bit more uncommon. And this is awesome. There's, like, diamond golems around protecting this place. Iron ingot. Really hoping for some armor. Owned. He was like red. Saw him for like a half a second there. Yeah, this place is actually pretty safe with my girlfriend and with um all the golems up here. It feels really weird saying my girlfriend. Alright, a bunch of seats. I don't need seats. I don't need them. This is going to be hard to remember which buildings I went into. This place is actually pretty massive. There's a golden block right here. 
And yeah, I don't have anything to mine it with. And cool, it's actually right next to a gold golem. So chance of that. <laughs> a little zombie. And there's another gold golem. And we'll check this structure over here. There's only like one building like all the way at the end. There's like creepers all over the place. They're just, they're just like peacefully sitting there. Dirt golem here. But yeah, we definitely have a lot of choices. The new ones um, from today that I saw at least was this like flying village. We've got um, the spot from last season too. And also those cool statues. I think it might look pretty cool there. Because I haven't seen those before. And it looks to lead to a dungeon of some sort. We'll have to check that out. But right now, I'm hoping to get some gear for next time. So we can actually, you know, conquer a real dungeon. You know, right now we're not that powerful, obviously. Gotta be careful. There's a bunch of creepers and stuff around here. Switch to my weapon. Creeper. He seems normal. Go off the edge. Fall off. Don't break it. Don't break it. Okay, thank God. That was weird. He's, he's trying to get back up. All right, now he's gone. Or not. That is weird. That freaks me out a little bit. She's staring at it, too. She's like, what do we do? Answer is I have no idea. All right, so, yeah, there's a lot of monsters around here now. It's actually getting pretty dangerous. <laughs> Got to be careful here. All right, anything in here? There's some bread. There's another saddle. We're getting a lot, which is perfect for animal bikes. So we can have, like, so many, like, animal bikes going. Zombie over there. And, yeah, the golems are awesome. Come here, spider. Die. Yeah. I got him that time. I can kill stuff, too, you know. All right. So I have to switch back. The thing is, with battle gear installed, I can easily, like, accidentally hit one of these dudes, which would be really bad. All right. Because if I left-click or right-click, I attack, so... You know, it's a little bit different. All right, so what is in here? So many chests. Haven't gotten anything too good, though. Ex excuse me. Why do you stand on the chest anyway? It's rude. A bunch of arrows. You okay? Wait, do you land on the ceiling for some reason? All right, so I think there's only a couple more chests, and then we'll fly up and check everything out. Ooh, the first obsidian golem. It's the one with the most health, 150. Yeah, I'm glad I added in this mod. I wasn't sure, like, how useful it would be. But I think it's just cool in general to go with this mod, if you know what I mean. Like, it looks really cool since it, like, ha Oh, my God, a mutant creeper on the roof. There's a mutant creeper on the roof over there. Why must they spawn that? All right, um, let's see here. See, the thing is, we're actually not strong enough to literally take one out yet. So we have to be really careful. There's a lot of freaking skeletons with, like... Arrows and they even have like extra arrows on them. Oh, no Okay, there she is. Thank God. That was actually funny. She falls off and she just teleports back Yeah, she is not very, you know coordinated apparently 40 health. I like how it gets it happens to her instead of me I think the thing is though did they even drop the gear unless I'm the one that kills them Sorry. Oh, that's why that's why you switch. I'm so sorry. I really apologize. I'm probably going to have to... <laughs> well, once we leave, he won't be mad at me anymore. So it'll be fine. I think that's all the structures. Yeah, I just mentioned it too. And the first thing I did was I punched an emerald golem. Like, that's the one you want to mess with. The emerald one. That's like one of the worst ones. Okay, so we're going to check around here. And see if there is any around. Any chests, that is. You're like, any what, Pat? Chests. All right, so I'm not seeing many. I'm seeing a lot of zombies. This place is actually really dangerous. There's really not... Oh, there's a chest right there. All right, I see one. Let me make sure. There's, like, scorpions on, like, roofs and stuff. And I can't really see... The Ender Dragon is so big. And they changed the controls for it, which I'm not used to. Because used to be when you um, hit left shift, it didn't dismount you. It actually brought you down, so I'm not used to that. Let me grab this. Come on, come back. This place is getting more dangerous. Wish it was daytime. And yeah, I'm going to set up telepads here and stuff like that. Because we really need to. Can't see very good. Really? Not that many chests. You'd think there'd be more. Usually there's a ton when I look. And my angle is terrible. Um, let me check this one all the way down here. Got a bad feeling about it. Yeah, there really isn't too much when it comes to chests today. Um, in this place for some reason. I don't know why. It's alright though. Let's see. So there's one more. I cannot control this dude today. He's he's acting crazy. All right, land on the thing. My girlfriend even she made it. I can make it too. Ooh, a diamond. We got a diamond. 
So guys, one thing I know I have to do. Where is my dragon? Where did he go? I don't know. Did he fall somehow? Eh, yeah, maybe he did. I don't know. Checking the sky. They can't fall. Usually they just float. I don't know, but I do need to go under the castle floor. I know there's some diamonds there too in our actual house, which I will do pretty soon. So don't worry about that, guys. We will definitely check that out. Right now, I really wanted to like find a spot for the mansion, and I think there's a couple good choices now. All right. Oh, land. What do you guys do? <laughs> there's something wrong with animal bikes compared to the in the newest update because they used to just float there. They didn't just fall to their doom. I have to check to see if they ended out down there. But yeah, we can take another quick look around the area and see if there's any cool structures. It seems like in the desert there's some cool stuff. Let's head a little bit like further into um this direction. Kind of into the plains. Ember scorpions are around here too. That can't be good. There's so much bad stuff around. And don't worry, I'm sure my girlfriend will find me. But yeah, anything cool around here? I just want to get like a quick look of the land around and there could be something awesome. You never know. Come on, anything cool. There's a jungle here. Hmm. I can check towards the water too. You never know what there's going to be around here. There's some kind of underwater thing, underwater structure. That's cool. But yeah, I'm just trying to find some stuff for you guys to choose from. And I guarantee you, I will start it next time. But anyways, guys, I think I'm going to end it here. I really don't know where I'm going right now. I'm just kind of like wandering around. And it is lagging a tiny bit too. Probably because I never like generated this area before. And, yeah, there's, like, floating villages, like, everywhere around here. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.